draw me a Navy SEAL. Uh, first Navy SEAL that was killed in the war on terror in Afghanistan in 2002. Uh, all it says is Neil Roberts. So I'm using Pinterest again. But he was the first Navy SEAL and I want to see if I can uh, draw him with his pen with no uh, pencil to help me out. I don't know how this is going to turn out, but my favorite pen, I'm uh, using my number three, which is the .35 millimeter, and we're going to go from there. Let's see, I think, now I got me a dot right here somehow, I got me a dot on, on the paper, so I'm going to try to make that part of his eye, so I'm going to start down here with his nose and just see where it goes. I don't really know much about his history. I just been looking around. I ain't draw the Navy SEAL yet. And I said, you know what, I draw a Navy SEAL. <laughs> Using my favorite pencil, pen. Uh, this is unusual for me to be drawn on a, a, a Tuesday. I usually take Tuesday and maybe most time, you know, Wednesday off to try to recuperate from work. I talked about it before, it takes a lot out of you, especially your hands. I mean, I don't really don't want to be gripping this pen too much. Where's my hands at when I draw? Right, you know, like after I uh, work, mess around with, you know, mess around with that freight. Them boxes, you, uh, a lot of picking up and everything with your hands, so, uh, and I'm going to start doing this more often, maybe, uh, just seeing if I can start learning how to draw without any, uh, like, pencil action or anything. See if I can get away from that and just see if I'm able to learn or draw close enough to the real, the picture, I reckon, I'm trying to draw, maybe. See like that picture? That right here is already bigger than the other one, but so what? I mean, how am I going to learn? To, uh, I think it will help me uh, memorize my subject matter more going with a uh, pen, right? Then a uh, pencil. Maybe if I make this side a little bit bigger. I got to plug my laptop in there to keep going out on me to uh, the picture anyway. Yeah, uh, as it, I'll look up the, uh, who he was and everything once I'll uh, finish my rendition of him. But, uh, you know what? I can actually get my phone out. It's in the living room right here. And I can ask Google who he was. And uh, we go from there. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to start doing more pictures like this. I think if I do it like this, I have to concentrate more, but at, at the same time, try not to worry about it as much, if that makes sense to y'all. And just, uh, you know, just take it for what it is. I don't know how old this picture is compared to what he might have looked like when he was deployed. If this was like, you know, before going to ask, I, I'm assuming this, he's got green camo on right here. And I, I'll show y'all a picture at the end of this, but I want to try to, you know, not mess him up too bad. Uh, and just kind of go by what he looked like, I reckon. I could actually pull that back a little bit, but that's okay. It's all about learning, right? And don't sweat the small stuff. Cause it's gonna, it'll get you, it'll eat you up if you, sure I messed up a little bit here and there, but how am I gonna learn, right? If I worry about all the little bitty small stuff. See that right here? That looks kind of weird, but that's him. 
and uh, I think I get a better appreciation uh, doing a good job every time or trying to do you know trying to do a good job for these you know these heroes I call them heroes like you know guys and gals are written that is falling for this country you know uh, try to do them a little bit of justice I mean, he had kind of like curly hair I don't know how to exactly I ain't never really had to draw curly hair so I just kind of put some stuff on the can y'all see that okay. uh, I just try to put some stuff on the screen and it's going to be just a quick sketch and we're going to like last week I done the sailboat and the uh, old man uh, but right now we're going to just uh, mess around with his hair a little bit kind of, kind of give him some hair and then uh, the ear was right down right around here and it just kind of come out up into his hair right there. Right below his eye. Now this ain't gonna be super proportionalized. And uh we'll go from here to the next one. Uh oh that looks pretty pretty good. I'll show you in a minute. Uh it's alright. I want to get good enough where I can just do this, looking at something and, you know, knock out back to back if I wanted to, super act or close to realistic accuracy as I possibly can with these, this any picture, where the, if it's a human, you know, a sailboat, buildings, I'm going to start doing building, uh, sea landscapes, farms, uh, I made his hair a little bit too, too much, but. You know, that's what it is. You learn and you, you move on. But I kind of feel him in right here, so I don't look too crazy on him. Uh, you'll see his neck right here. Make sure y'all can see this. You'll see his neck right here plunging down into his uniform. It was kind of offset the picture shooting at that side of his face compared to his left side of his face where which be our right side uh he had a big old neck he probably big old muscles there you know uh i probably i can't really tell a lot about his uniform uh od camouflage old style camouflage from the probably the 80s or something or like in woodland camo I reckon uh, you would have like in Germ East uh, Germany our guys being over there or whatever uh, a little bit of shade out here but basically this whole face is really is not shaded uh, it messes out right there I wish I didn't do that but you know what I think you know, make it work a little bit <coughs> Uh, yeah, his mouth right here, but you can't really see it. I'll show y'all. You can't. I don't really want to mess his mustache up, but it's it's right here. Uh, and you really can't see his lips, so I ain't gonna do too much to mess that up. But uh, I'm gonna learn how to do that shading. But there's his uh, with. Pen, right with pens. I'm gonna learn how to do a shading a little bit better so I can make these draws a little bit better. I can't really, uh, I think there's a little shadow right here, maybe. I mean, I this is not gonna be like super uh proportionalized to what he actually looks like, and uh. Cause I, I ain't nowhere near what I need to be with these pins yet. Cause I always back in the day on these other drawings, like my, my soldier and marine I done already. Uh, I had pencil and I went back and forth through there a hundred times throughout that video. I just had it going so fast you probably couldn't see it all. But 
it was there. Let's try to make this look a little bit more realistic. There once about let's see there. I done it. I I'm with this picture. I lost it. There he is. And uh, let me get back to putting this stuff down. Sorry about that. Uh, I wanted to get his picture back. <clears throat> and I want to... Uh, I'm going to pull his uh, profile up on Google. And we can talk, see who he was actually. I get that. Well, ask Google who he was. Who was Neil Roberts, first Navy SEAL killed in action? <clears throat> Let's see. We didn't say much about him. He was a first class petty officer. Fell out of the helo during a firefight. And he received a Navy Cross. I think there was a... Evacuating or something like that. Uh, and uh, during a firefight, he did receive a Navy Cross. So. But... Uh, Anyhow, he lost his life, but he was in a firefight and uh, first kill in action in Afghanistan. First, well, I'm sorry, first Navy SEAL killed in uh, action in Afghanistan. And uh, I don't know, I think I do it a lot. I'll show y'all. Uh, we check out. Okay, that's him. Maybe should have colored a uh, mustache in, but I just want to do a quick one. Oh, there he is. He got curly hair. And uh, really wasn't too many shadows I can work with. Uh, I didn't want to color his eyes in. I might have messed that up. But uh, this is him right here, so that ain't too bad right here, I don't reckon. Anyhow, I'm going to start doing more of these. Uh, and we'll uh, we'll go from there. All right. Uh, get back on him one more time. That's a pretty good job. I'm gonna upload this real quick and uh, do another one while I'm still uh, feeling like I want to really, you know, try to do some more than that. All right. Thank y'all for watching. Uh, first U.S. Navy SEAL killed in action. First class petty officer. Neil Roberts. Uh, either way you look at it, uh, American hero, I reckon. I would think, in my own words, and I guarantee his family and his teammates and a lot of Americans think that, you know. Uh, dangerous stuff they're doing across the seas, and they're still over there. Army, Navy, Marine Corps, all of them. Uh, thank you for watching. Right, bye. bye.